rather simply found or calculated. Okay? So, people, you, know, you know, some students might call me being tricky when, 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 when I do things, when, when I give you questions like that. But, but, you know, I think if I'm telling you I'm being tricky in a specific way, <laughs> it doesn't. Like, it's 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 <laughs> oh, it's <so> tricky. <laughs> it doesn't make it better. So I should say nothing. Well, I mean, you should tell us what problem. Tell us what problem. Tell us what problem. I can't win for losing. That sounds like the title of a country music song. Should I? I can't win for losing. Chrissy? Collaborating. Are you? Should we talk about if I'm going to get royalties because I chose the right song? Right. No. If his name's not on it. Creative differences. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, if, if his, I mean, legally, if you're not the copyright holder, or the uh, publisher, no monies. Did you get a hot text message? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. Uh, is the final the only cumulative test, or do all your tests like build on each other? Well, they I mean, do you still have to know what's a debit? Well, I understand like <laughs> that, but I'm saying like you know. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you, like, no, I'm not going to specifically, but I guess. That, like, yes, I, I, actually, and the and the Magnificent Seven mm -hmm. is still there, and so that was on the first test, mm -hmm. right? Spe very specifically, but then we we tweaked one T account. Which one? Manufacturing, Manufacturing overhead, and now we've got job order costing, and so like all the T account stuff from the first mm -hmm. test, and so, but nothing specifically first test ish, but. But I, but I like to think that you, you remember some of that stuff, you know, particularly the stuff that builds upon that old stuff. Okay. You know, like, what's a debit? Okay. <laughs> Catherine! <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I was primed to look at you because your card's on top as well. So the poor guy, so I'm, so I'm ready, so I'm, I'm kind of primed to ask her the first question and she, she's got a big yawn that uh, kind of coordinated with, is it? Now it is. <laughs> so let's talk about something, let's talk about, what do you want, oh, what question are we answering? What's the big question that we're answering? How much does it cost? We know three ways to answer that question. Name one of them. Sadie? And we know three ways to answer that question. Can you name one of those three ways? Are you talking about like the job order? Job order. Okay. Job order. And then what's the third word? Costing. Costing. Job order costing. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Angie, can you name another one? And, and say, I'm doing good here. I, I, Angie's drinking when I call her name. Activity-based Activity -based costing. And Brett, not here. Heidi, what's the last one? Process costing. Process costing it is. Okay. Cody. How are you? Awesome. Do you like the warming weather? No. You like it colder? Like snow? So you like it warmer? Okay. Kind of in the middle. Not too hot, not too cold. Uh, what question do you want me to ask you? You have any preferences? No? You sure? What page are you on in the, in, the, in the handy handbook? What's on page 232? You're not there. You're not on the same page as Cody. The John the jo oh, the jo oh, that's kind of a random page. <laughs> How about if we go back? <laughs> What's the first job order costing page? 135? We've already answered that. 136. Ah, how about 137? 
Page, let's look at page 137. What is the absorption costing income statement format there, Cody? <laughs> you got it? Page 137? 137's on the right side. Oh, it's blank. No wonder he's kind of... You know what, though? What, what other page can we find this on? The... the uh, yeah, our camera person is not very happy with me right at the moment. I'm not supposed to be in the back row. What other page can we find the uh, oh, Here's this blank, too. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. I, I apologize. I, I apologize. I what other format? What other page can we find this on? I don't know, but I got it on Anybody? The huh? What other page? It should have been way early. Look, David. Well, because he doesn't have it filled in. I think it's out. It is a lot of pages. What page? 13. 13. Wow. Do you have it on page 13? There you go. What's the absorption costing? And now you want to copy these back to that other page. So what's the absorption costing income statement format? Uh, revenue minus cost gets sold. Revenue minus cost gets sold. Equals? Or GM stands for. <coughs> Did you listen to her? Gross margin. Gross margin. And then minus what? Perfect. Revenue minus cost of goods sold equals gross margin minus selling and administrative expenses equals operating, operating income. income. Aubrey, how about variable cost and income statement for me? Um, revenue minus variable cost equals contribution minus fixed cost equals operating income. Operating income. Operating income. Perfect. Revenue minus variable cost equals contribution margin minus fixed cost equals operating income. <sighs> What's on the next page? Oh, there we've got our three thing dealy bobbers. <laughs> <laughs> That's it's a highly technical accounting word. Dealy bobbers. <laughs> It will not be on the exam, I can assure you. <laughs> Scott, can you read his notes? Better, better than yours? <laughs> That's what that means. I missed that class. And you have not watched the videos? What did you do during spring break? Clearly not watching Dr. Fessler's videos. <laughs> You don't have to answer that question, but clearly you were not watching. You know, but you, you know, you, you, YouTube, you can get, I can watch YouTube on my phone anymore. You, you could be on the beach <laughs> watching Dr. Fessler. <laughs> what? <laughs> Is that right? Okay, Scott, what are you copying down? <laughs> Tell me about this information you're copying down. Page 138. What kind of products would we use job order costing for? Distinct products. Very good. What kind of products would we use process costing for, Taylor? Homogenous products. Carrie, can you give me an example of a distinct product? Now, Pamela, you might want to write some of these down. I'm sorry? An oil well is a good example. Brandon, can you give me another example? 